Well, hello everybody. Welcome to Alien Isolation playthrough. I uh, just uh, downloaded this game on Steam today, and man, I had a heck of a time getting it to run. Uh, I would start the game, and I, it would just crash, and I get a message saying AI.exe has stopped working. And you know, I did some search on the internet and didn't really find much. Uh, I hate it when I feel like I'm the only person who's having a, a problem. I mean, I saw other people with uh, the AI.exe stopping, but uh, that was like they were trying to play the game on a card that only does DirectX 10 or something like that. And my card it does do DirectX 11. Um, so <laughs> I think I read somewhere where one guy actually like deleted the local files and then re-downloaded it from Steam, and that worked for him. Uh, so I tried that, and that didn't work. I uh, updated my NVIDIA drivers. I reverted back to old NVIDIA drivers, uninstalled them, reinstalled them. Uh, nothing worked. And then uh, finally, the only thing that got it to work was um, physically uh, disconnecting my second monitor. I actually just reached around behind it and pulled out the DVI cable. And now the game loads just fine. It loads just fine. So it's going to be a pain in the ass that every time I want to play this game, I have to disconnect my second monitor. Uh, let's see. I hope it was supposed to do that. Uh, I'm not going to change anything in here. I'm just going to leave it as is. Uh, as far as controls, I'm going to be using a uh, mouse and keyboard. Uh, not not the uh, controller. So input mapping. I already went through. I'm an EDSF guy. I already changed all my controls to the way I want them. Oh. I didn't change anything. Uh, so let's get out of here. Okay, well let's um, let's fire this bad boy up. I'm not sure what to expect. I'm a huge Alien fan. Love uh, both Alien and Aliens. Uh, so I was excited when this came out. It's getting mixed reviews, so I'm not really sure what to believe. So I'm just going to um, uh, make up my own mind here. So we got Alien Isolation, Crew Expendable, Downloadable Content. I'll get to that later. Uh, I don't know what these are, but let's just uh, play Alien Is Isolation. Oh gosh, do I get to pick a, um... Oh, there we go. Easy, medium, or hard. I'm going to go with, um, medium. Ooh, the recommended way to experience the game. Challenging and terrifying. Really? Oh gosh. I don't know, man. If I was just playing it by myself and I wasn't recording it... Oh man. Yep, let's do it. Just a slider until the Siegson logo is barely visible against the black background. I don't see it. I don't see anything. There we go. I want to brighten it up just a little bit more than usual because usually when I record, um, things come out darker. So uh, we'll go with that. Oh, do I actually have to hit the enter button? Oh, I thought that was going to be a cutscene. Final report of the commercial starship Nostromo. Third officer reporting. The other members of the crew, Kane, Lambert, Parker, Brett, Ash, and Captain Dallas are dead. Cargo and ship destroyed. I should reach the frontier in about six weeks. With a little luck, the network will pick me up. This is Ripley. Last survivor of the Nostromo. Signing off. Man, I hope this is good. I mean, that was Sigourney Weaver's voice, right? If it wasn't, it sure sounded like her. Ripley? Okay. I'm Samuels. I work for the company. It 
It's about your mother. We think we may have found her, Amanda. A commercial vessel, the Anisadora, has recovered what we believe to be the flight recorder unit of the Nostromo. Where? Zeta Reticula. What did it tell you? We don't know. The unit was taken to Sevastopol Station. It's proprietorial material, so the company wants it to be collected as soon as possible. Sevastopol's a supply depot in the region. It's a permanent freeport. I facility. know what it is. Transit's arranged. There's a courier ship called the Torrens heading out that way in two days. We're going to travel out. We? Oui. Me and another exec. And you, if you're willing. Look, Ripley, when this job came across my desk, I read the case history. I know why you're working in the region where she went missing. You're still looking, aren't you? I've been cleared to offer you a place on the Torrance if you want to come along. Maybe there'll be some closure for you. Wow, those were really good graphics. Really good graphics. Ooh, is this me now? Do I get to move around now? Ah, please sign in. Huh, use move keys to walk. Don't, okay, V, sign in. I have V mapped as my use button. It's just an old habit I have from the original Half-Life, for whatever reason, the original Half-Life, when I played it back in 1998, I uh, had the uh, use button mapped to V in every game since then. I've done the same thing. Torrens? Torrens, or is that the name of the system? Oh, Connor, Taylor, Verlaine, Ripley, Samuels. Okay. Let's sign in, shall we? Ah, good thing I had that on me. Welcome, A. Ripley. Explore the Torrens. Okay, I can do that. Holy mackerel, those are good graphics. I really like the way this looks. Get dressed. Aw, oh, man. Hey, I can see my feet. Oh, I can't jump. Oh, actually, you know what? I don't think there was a jump button when I mapped the keys. I don't think there was. Frank Herman War in totality. Do I put my shoes on? Get dressed. Okay. Well. Um. What if I don't want to get dressed? What if I just want to run around in my skivvies? Can I do that? Alright, I'm going to guess I'm supposed to go down this way. Boy, I feel really tall. I feel like my head is just brushing the um, top of the ship there. Ah. Yeah, like I'm going to bump my head. Oh, what do we have we here? Ah, uh, yes. You know, that old guide. I've read it a million times. Um, is there one of these that says Ripley on it? Um, is there a, uh... Okay, here we go. I pressed uh, my tab key to get to this. Explore the Torrens. Explore the ship before you arrive at Sevastopol Station. Okay. Uh, get dressed. Okay, I guess that's my... My goal. And is this me? And I'm looking in that direction? Is that what that is? So I need to kind of turn left and go this way? Let's see. Let's look at the map again. Yes. Well, I figured that out pretty easily. That's cool. So we'll go down here and take the next right. What else is what else is on here? We got some hypersleep chambers, so I guess that's where I came from. 
Galley, medical, airlock. All right. Let us go in here and uh, put on some clothing. So, nothing on my HUD tells me where to go. Well, good thing I have a map. Ah. I'm gonna take a shower. Yes. I mean, I just woke up. I don't know about you guys, but when I wake up in the morning, I take a shower. Okay. That's good. I mean, we are on a spaceship. There's probably not a whole lot of water to waste, so um, we'll just leave it at that. Is this my locker? Get dressed. I'm dressed. All right. Do I get an achievement for that? What's this all about? Use. Is anything going to happen? Use. Oh, I can turn it on and off. Okay. Uh, okay, well, we're all signed in. Whatever that means. Uh, what's this guy been looking at? Use registration points to manually save your progress. They will warn you if enemies are nearby. Registration points. What? Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Huh. Whoop. Oh. Right clicking makes a little sound. I don't know what it does. What's this? Archive logs. Personnel log. Oh my, there's a lot of people there. Okay. Um. So where's this um, archive point they were talking about? Where is this? Where was it? It showed up. Here? Here! Oh, okay, save game. Are you sure you want to override your save data? Yes. Yes, I'm sure. It's an important save point. You know, I, I don't I don't want to have to do that again. I don't have to get dressed again. That was horrible. Okay. So, um, I'm supposed to do what now? What's my goal? Um, okay. Oh, okay. I guess I'm supposed to speak to Taylor. Taylor is uh, down here and to the right. It's a nice looking ship. It's nice and bright. At least this part of it is. We left their crap out. What's this say? Engine maintenance and repair. In here, right? I think this is where I'm supposed to go. Ah, Taylor is a female. Hello, Taylor. Taylor, good morning. Ripley, it's certainly not good. I very much doubt it's morning either. Oops. Sorry. I feel like death. I don't know how you people put up with hypersleep regularly. You get used to it. I don't do long haul very often. Most legal execs don't travel further than the coffee machine. I'm surprised Wayland yutani felt the need to send legal at all. The loss of the Nostromo and its cargo cost the company a lot of money. It's important we find out what happened. If I can close the case with a conclusive accident report, it'll look great with my superiors. I'm sorry. That was insensitive. Realize your mother has been missing for 15 years and you... It's okay. We'll both get what we want, right? Uh, have you seen Samuels? He's probably been up for hours. I'll catch up with him. I spoke to Taylor. Damn, I'm good at this game. Man, two for two! She's uh, interesting looking. I mean, um, I wouldn't say that uh, she looks realistic. She looks like a real doll, actually. <laughs> Not that I know what a real doll is. Uh, she looks like she's made out of plastic, but um, I still like the graphics. I, I, I really like them. They're real smooth and uh, sharp and um, pretty. Ah, uh, yes. I do believe that in the original Alien movie, there was a dream catcher of sorts hanging from a similar location on the Nostromo. And that concludes my knowledge of the Alien movie. No, I'm just kidding. I've seen it. I saw it, well, yeah, a long time ago. And, uh, and I saw it fairly recently as well. 
Okay, um, not that you care about that. So now I guess I'm going to go speak to Samuels. Oh, okay, looks like there's two ways I could go to get to Samuels. So we're going to go down here, I think. Oh, first of all, I'm going to look in here. Wow, look at that. Look at all those cassettes. Trust. Ah, okay. Let's say, say trust. Thrust, my bad. Thrust. That makes a little bit more sense. Well, gamey game. All right. Neat ship. This is cool. Am I going the right way? Yes. We'll go down here. We'll hang a right. Ah. I tell you though, I would imagine that if you're playing this game or if you're interested enough to watch someone else play it, you're probably an Alien fan. But if you have not seen the movie Alien, stop watching this and go watch Alien. It is fantastic. <laughs>